We are back, ladies and gentlemen. Lance is not his back. I call this first thing, whatever that says. Lice, is it? I don't know. I randomed it. That's what I got. Get on my level, and we are ready to go. And in this new episode, we'll be testing the almighty Imperial Buccalaris. If that is how you say it, I probably don't say it right, so someone will probably correct me, so thank you for that. And we're going to see how powerful these units are. So, to start things off, we need to get the Imperial Recruits. Not the special units, because the Imperial Recruits, as you'll see with the Archer line, it will go to those units what we need. The Buccalaris who are actually very strong units i believe because i've used them before they're a poor man's current guards but they are still very strong let's stockpile these guys and move on now we've got all our men in it's time to now address the more important thing the money my goodness i need money i'm gonna be a pay on those buddy can you donate a pound a month donation ads so we all know what's coming next let's all say it together it's tournament time always betting yourself easy money my goodness look at the state of him he looks like a mess doesn't he and he's also dead yes so we win more tournaments and we sell all our rewards look at that our money is good enough now but it can get better let's get a carver underway who do we choose yes i'm boring i know i know i can't help it that's the reason why it's just too appealing go and make me money because god i need it now we just need to get the healer in so we can start the carnage on the bandits or looters i wonder who i'll go for ah i bet you thought i was going for the surgeon didn't you well i thought i'd spice things up with the scholar also because the surgeon didn't actually load into my game you can't argue with that though that is a ridiculously high stat we are now ready for warfare start with this smelly weirdo this is great because this will clear out the weak oh you two got a Lucky, you two got lucky. You got another chance. Let's carry on the onslaught. So we continue to harass looters again and again until the veteran archers. But now I forget they need horses now to get into the buccaneers. So I need more money. So we all know what's coming. It's tournament time. I don't understand how I only knocked them out. I am using the exact same weapon I would on an actual battlefield. It's weird. All right, after all those battles, let's just sell the rewards. Look at that. Now let's get the horses in. Oh, so much money. I really hope you fall off your horses all right let's test out these units then not bad they're actually not bad now that the men are sorted we need to sort out our armor the good thing is the money situation is still pretty good your boy is looking absolutely menacing but ouch the good thing is we're now clan tier level one thanks to those tournaments we all know what's coming more i can also join as a mercenary and we all know who we're joined don't we it's time to simp all over again let's go as usual that wall was someone this time it's the series and it's only to start, really. Not even a week gone. A few casualties inflicted, but no prisoners. We'll have to change that. First victim. Or should I say victims? Wow, what a hard fair test. This will be major. Let's see where it goes. You know what? They're doing better than I thought. Ow. Jeez, he just took my head off. We win anyway. Wow, they did absolute bits, to be fair. May lost a few there, but ultimately that was an amazing first test. After an amazing first test, let's test them out again. This time in a massive army scale. Let's see how they do. It's all out warfare. Ouch. He got me straight in the head with that. Jeez. Yay, we won. They did pretty decent. I wouldn't say it was amazing, but they did pretty decent. I mean, I could have done better. How many times have I been knocked out already? Let's see if I can survive this one. What I like about these units is the fact that you can just hit them far away and just be the biggest a-holes on the planet. We love a quick slaughter. I do like these units. They do damage, but they are very suspect to damage too. Here we go again. Wow, that's a lot of damage and half our army hasn't even arrived yet. Wow, this is a massacre. Wow. Just wow. My goodness. And thanks to those big battles, we're now clan tier level 2, which means we can now join as an actual vessel. Hello, my empress. I'd like to join you full time as a simp. I mean vassal. I meant vassal. And we might as well just sell all our rewards. Look at that. Looking good. Oh, look at that. They gave me a castle straight away. I did nothing to earn that, but I'll gladly take it. Time to earn this castle. Okay. What? What just happened? What was that? Was it that catapult? No way that can reach us. Is it the one? F I, I don't know what happened. I don't know what the hell just happened there. Jeez, look at the carnage on this wall. That was not the best showing for my troops or me. Have I been knocked down every single battle so far? Yay, another castle I didn't deserve. Big city siege incoming. Here we go. Hey, as if we just threw a rock at me end. The question is, everyone, will I survive this time? No. No, I will not. I didn't do that well again, but I blame myself, to be honest. My God, I'm getting slapped in this episode. I still win the city. 
I don't know how or why. Look at these people trying to take my castle. It'll be the last thing you do. Well, that's a problem, though. Abuse the bow and arrow just so I can actually survive for once. I survived! Much better for my army. Another big city siege incoming. This is one of the easiest walls I've ever taken. I survived again. I am the greatest. Uh, yeah, my units did bits there. 218 and you lost five. Yeah, okay. And now because of all those battles and sieges, we're now clan to level three. We know what that means. More! Now I've got the time. Let's just clear out the garrisons in the castles because it is a great way to make money, but it is a gamble. Ah, we didn't get the city that we just took, but I'm not surprised because we got the last one. And I'll give it to the main empress because I'm simping. Oh, what have I got myself into? Here we go. This might be a problem, but you know what? Why not? Go, my men. Do me proud. Wow, we are absolutely tormenting these guys. Damn, that was clean. Wow. We absolutely torment him. That was probably the best test yet. And now, big siege. There's no stopping us. And excuse me, please, if you don't mind, I want to get past this and get my merry way. Yay, I survived again. Oh, a very good battle there. Well done, guys. Ah, we don't even get the castle. I didn't want it anyway. Another big siege incoming, baby. Let me in. I have a horse. I have priorities. As a wise man once said, I have the high ground. And it didn't help me, apparently. We still win, though. I see that was a pretty good battle from them. We lost eight. And yet again, I get overlooked. Lovely. And now we're making peace with them. Again, I'm not surprised with that tribute, to be honest. I can't be bothered waiting, so let's just go to war with the Northern Kingdom, because why not? And straight into a siege of it. Hey, everyone, I hope you're enjoying the episode. If so, don't forget to give that like and subscribe button the manly slap possible for me. It'll help with the channel and the algorithm, and I appreciate that. Thank you. Also, if you're feeling like it, don't forget to leave a cheeky comment. Now, back to the siege. And yeah, that was a pretty boring siege. Yep, I don't get the castle again. Right, let's go for this big siege to finish this episode off, I reckon. There's a mad clutter going on here. Wow, look at this place. Wasteland. Yeah, they did all right there. Once it was amazing, but all right. Right, everyone, I think I'm going to leave the gameplay right there. It was a good, solid gameplay right there. Good, solid test with them all. Now, I'm going to test them even further by putting these units against the other horse archer units we've done in the this series so far in a custom battle i will see you there 1v1 is the mamluk heavy cavalry versus the buccularies what they're called here we go this is gonna be a super fight for now because it's gonna keep using the arrows let's just skip this until the one that runs out or they get close there we go now they're close here we go the advantage here is we're actually with the heavy cavalry i have to say because they do have a shield in fairness well it does not stop and now he's getting slashed oh my goodness okay the Buccularies, one little up. 10v10, here we go. Who will win? Let's just skip this along because there's going to be all the arrows flying by. First blow goes to the Heavy Cavalry, though. Here we go. Now they're getting up nice and close. Who will win this fight? Again, I do believe... Oh, it's one all now. I do strongly believe, though, the Heavy Cavalry should theoretically beat these up close because they do have access to a shield. And so far, it's pretty even. It's pretty even so far. I, I do think the Heavy Cavalry are going to win this, though, I have to say. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, they pulled it back. What is it now? 4v5. 4v5. Oh, 3v4. 3v4. 3v3. 2v3. Oh, there's only one left. And he's got no horse. He has no horse. He's not going to survive. He has no horse. There he goes. Down he goes. The heavy cavalry have won this fight. Now, time for the 100v100. Fight it out. Come on. I'm not going to lie. The heavy, the heavy cavalry are doing bits. What is it? Yeah, they're up by five. Four now. Three now. Oh, they're pulling it back. They're pulling it back. Look at this carnage going on. It's just skipping it along because it's going to be a load of... Oh, my goodness. The heavy cavalry are kicking their ass. They're destroying them right now. Look at that. They're absolutely destroying them. Yeah, the heavy cavalry have won this fire by a mile. By a mile. Well, I generally did not expect the heavy cavalry to actually beat... The bucket, the bucket celery is what they're called. Bucket, bucket celery, bucket celery is what they're called. I can never pronounce what they're called, but I, I was very surprised to see that. But they've absolutely blitzed them. Look at that, 45 of them remained. Well, it's safe to say that the heavy cavalry are in fact a better overall unit than them by the looks of it. Now, we have a right slaughter. We're, we're going to try the bucket celery is what they're called against the Khan guards. This is going to be a slaughter. All right, here we go. One v one, the Khan guard. Versus the Bucketellis or Bucketellis. Someone will probably tell me how you say it, but here we go. Surely they can't go to win this because they are, in my opinion, the best units in the game. So you'd like to win this. Just skip this bit along with the arrows. Yada, 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 The good thing for the Khan Guards is they do have access to, like, a big pole arm. So they do have that reach. 
So I feel like they will win this fight. Uh, yes, yes, he did. <laughs> well, there's one of them. Who would have thought they lost? 10v10, as you can see. Here we go. Who won this fight? <laughs> Who will win this fight? Come on, let's be honest. We all know who is winning this fight. The car guards should realistically demolish these units. They should demolish them. There, there's one. Just fast forward at this point because it's just it's just um just a bow and arrow, isn't it? You'll just see a load of misses. There you go, they're getting up nice and close now. Here we go. So far though, <laughs> the enemy got to kill you. The car guards are just bullying them. They, they haven't got any horses left. <laughs> Oh my goodness, again, even the horses are weak. It's just like, like, what are you supposed to do in this situation? Like, I don't know what these guys are doing. They're just going back and forward. What, what What's going on? They're, I mean, they're killing them, but look, they're just going back and forward. What are they doing? I need to see what they're doing up close. Let's have a look. They are trying to hit. I mean, this is just... There we go. Yep, yeah, there might be a clean sweep. Yep, there's one left. Clean sweep. Just kill him! Thank you. My goodness, I don't know what that was all about. Wow. Clean sweep. Look at that. Yep. Now let's just get on done with 100 versus 100. Let the carnage begin! <laughs> Look at this! Oh, they got one! Yeah! They got one! They got one! They got two! Oh, they got three! Yay! Three kills! Three kills! Most of them have already lost their horses! Yeah! <laughs> I mean, how many horses? Oh, one of their own units has killed, killed one of their own, like... <laughs> That's funny. And it's over. Look, they're, they're running away. Yay. Look at that. Look at that. They took out eight of them. It wasn't even eight. One of them took themselves out. So technically, they only killed seven. They got batted. I expect no less, though, from the great Khan guards. Right, now that we've done that, let's go over to the ranking system. I'll see you there. Right, everybody. We are here. We are back with the tier list, as you can see. And this time, we'll be ranking the Imperial Book... What was it book of salaries? I, I honestly I can't say these units. Why? Why do you have to make these units? Some of these units like spell so horrible. Like well, me personally, then based on the simple fact, when I put them, the fact that they lost to the heavy cavalry, I'm gonna put them there then, just for the simple fact that they lost to them. Like they shouldn't. I did not expect them to lose to the heavy cavalry. Let's put this straight. I did not expect them to lose to the heavy cavalry. I generally thought that these units were the second best like horse archers in the game, but I was wrong. Simple as that, I was wrong. The horses are very weak in terms of they don't survive long enough. They don't have that many arrows and ultimately they just, they just don't do that much damage. They don't have a shield or a lance. Yeah, these units are definitely in this tier by a mile mare, definitely. They're okay in some parts, but most of the time, they were just very squishy. Like, they're just a far worse unit than the Khan Guards. Like, again, I've said this many times. Like, if you're going to use Horse Archers, just go straight for the Khan Guards. Don't even bother with any other unit. But these were let down big time. So, what do you reckon, guys? Do you agree with my choice? Do you disagree? I would love to hear your opinion on it. Put in the comments down below. And that concludes the episode, everyone. I really hope you enjoyed this episode. I enjoyed making it. Don't forget to give that like and subscribe button the manly slap possible for me. It'll help with the algorithm and the channel, and I greatly appreciate it. And if you feel like it, don't forget to leave a cheeky comment. Do it. See you later, guys.